Hi, my name's Ruth. I'm the support coordinator at the Children's Tumor Foundation and I've been in that role for about a year. My background is in community development and before that many years working on magazines uh, in Sydney and all around the world. I didn't know a lot about NF before I started in the role, but when I saw the job advertised, I thought it's connecting people with information, it's connecting community members to each other, and it's connecting people to support, and that's what really interested me about the job. There is no typical day in this job, which is what I actually love about it. Uh, it's addressing concerns of community members, connecting community members to each other, developing programs that help support people, um, advocating on behalf of the community, community, encouraging people to advocate on behalf of themselves, um, connecting with researchers, doctors, politicians. It, it, there's no day that looks the same, which is great. I think the organisation in general is vital because we're one voice for the NF community rather than lots of different little voices having small little impacts. I feel that together we can really make a huge impact and make change happen and get awareness and advocacy and research and all those things happening. Well, I never know what to expect when I'm picking up the phone so it's really my job to listen to the needs of people and react to that and whether it's information, support, somebody to laugh with, somebody to cry with, somebody to connect them to other people, it's every person is different so whatever it is you need give us a call and hopefully we can help. The people, that's an easy one to answer whether it's um, teens, young adults, parents, adults, uh, the kids, um, it, it, for me that's what it's all about, it's the only reason I do this job is because uh, I get the chance to connect people with information and to see the transformation that that can have on people when they are empowered, it's incredible. The power that human connection can have in creating resilience in people. It's the privilege in sharing people's stories and being there to listen and it, it, it's really the little moments like when you're talking with somebody and you can hear in their own voice that they know that they're strong enough to cope with whatever lies ahead in front of them.